Manufacturers will develop paints to have certain characteristics. That could be anti-corrosion, waterproofing, or opacity. For the product to perform as the manufacturer has uh, intended, it needs to be applied at the right film thickness. On the technical data sheet, the manufacturer will tell you the recommended wet film and dry film thicknesses. So how do we ensure that we get our paint applied at the right film thickness? Well, one of the easiest ways is to use a wet film thickness comb, also known as a wet film thickness gauge. These come in several different forms. We've got two here that we can show you. This is a steel version, which is made to be reusable. And here we have a plastic one, which is meant to be disposable, or you could even keep it as a permanent record of any wet film thicknesses that you've measured. So as we can see here, these combs have teeth on each side and the teeth are different lengths. We rest the two shoulders at the end of each scale into the paint and then we can check to see which of the teeth are wet and that will indicate our film thickness. And in this case, in our wet applied sample here, the manufacturer has recommended a wet film thickness of 100 microns. So a good place to start is the scale with the 100 micron setting. So just place the comb into the wet paint, keep it at 90 degrees to the substrate, and then we can read off the last wet tooth. Now I'm gonna to have to put my glasses on to see the scale. And here we can see that the last wet tooth is on the 100 micron scale. So we know we've got our right wet film thickness, which will mean our dry film thickness will be correct. And this is particularly important when talking about things like fire protection, because for the protection to be to the required standard, we need to get the correct film thickness applied. And in a lot of cases, manufacturers will actually supply a wet film thickness comb with their material. If you have any further questions about wet film thickness gauges, how to use them, just want more information, then please feel free to give us a call.